Firestorm 5. Spending CO2 all the while here. Formidable flipper. But it's good driving. Oh, slamming it. Second seed are here. You've got through. Yep. <laughs> you are up against another flipper. Yep. Mute. Mute. It's flipping hell out there. Do you like that one? Oh, it's got that one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> cheers. Uh, what's your tactics going to be? Just go for them again. Just go straight in. Uh, I don't think they've actually managed to get under anyone so far. So I think they've been flipping people with the, the, the back flip that they've got. So uh, we'll just see how it goes. Good luck out there, you two. Thank you. A two-wheel drive wedge-shaped flipper at 94 kilos, fast manoeuvrable, but it is only two-wheel drive. From Stoke on Trent. <laughs> Firestorm 5 in underneath Mute. Mute with 0.6 centimetres of ground clearance. 96 kilos is the heavier, would you believe it? Firestorm 5 relentless, pressurising. Mute hopping away. Expending CO2 all the while here. A little bit of an experience showing, perhaps. Oh, it looks dramatic. It looks lovely, doesn't it? Yeah, Fred Astaire will be proud. But Fred Astaire will be beaten by Firestorm 5, I would guess. And Firestorm 5 away and across the arena floor. And I think Mute was knocked into unconsciousness, but it's knocked out of the arena anyway. An experience show for me. Cease. Too tight to the arena sidewall. They daren't try and self-right. Not from there, they'd have hopped out themselves. And Firestorm, the coup de grace. Measuring, clinical, and there's the kill. Well, mute self-writer is all wrong. Firestorm, they go burning through! Do to your robot. Come here, come here. Look what they've got to do. How did your robot get that far out of the arena? Uh, press the flipper release button and it kind of fired itself out. So you flipped off the back of them then? Yes. Because you had that awkward dilemma there. You were there, and if you if, if you self righted, you were going to hurdle the uh, the barrier, weren't you? It's a bit save a bit of face, I think, throwing ourselves out. <laughs> Kamikaze. Kamikaze. Harry Carey. <laughs> Listen, um, when you've got a self writer that yeah. can't get you back on your wheels, it does eventually. It's not a self writer, is it? It does, it does look good, though. It, it, it looks brilliant. <laughs> yeah. I mean, doing somersaults. Not much but use, but. It's not going to win your battles. No. And when you're up against the second seeds. Uh, yeah. When we came down that once, we seemed to put a couple of scrapes on yeah. Firestorm 5, so. So you, you're hoping for a damage thing where from the oh, judges. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> forks down into them. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please, the great Roboteers, they are mute! Yeah. They're mute, but they can't off talk. <laughs> um, easy peasy. I was worried going into it, though. Definitely. Was you? Yeah. I mean, you've seen the way the, the flipper works. If they had been slightly lower on the ground, yeah. then we would have been probably out the arena. Because it is powerful, it's isn't it? Very powerful. But yeah. they couldn't get underneath yet. No, we just had that, that edge. We've got the, the move, removal strip on the front, so yeah. if we take damage, we can change the strip, so we really, really low. Second seed. Mm. Pressure's on. It is. There's not many seeds left. They, you they, always they, get through to the finals. You always get to the finals. So, um, are you going to make it this time? I'll give it a good shot. All right. Hope your luck holds out anyway. Let's hear it. Firestorm! <laughs> Join me after the break for some down and dirty destructive devastation when Robot Wars semi finals continues. Storm 2. Very progressive, very impressive. The machine of Ed Hobbit, Tim Bentz and Meryl Kolak. Firestorm 5. The old stages. Will they again finish third in the competition? Can they win it this time, Graham Bone and Hazel Heslop? Roboteers, stand by. In the arena for the house robots, Growler. First time we've seen him in the semi-finals. Matilda in there again. Three, two... Storm 2 is the most impressive robot of its type since the emergence of Tornado. Might even be better than Tornado. Gonna survive here though. 
against the formidable flipper that is Firestorm 5. And for me, only a game of opinions, the best driver in the competition in Graham Bow. Backing away. <laughs> Isn't that just like it? I say he's a good driver, he hits the arena side wall. That's in underneath Storm 2, though. And the Storm 2 bounced to suddenly come away. I don't know whether you noticed that. Firestorm 5 again crashes against the arena wall as Hazel looks on. Design draftswoman by trade. Ah, Storm 2 behind Firestorm 5. That's interesting in underneath. Pit was released. Down it goes. Firestorm 5 dangerous. This for a place in the grand final. Firestorm 5 have been there before twice. But Storm 2 suddenly look menacing and they're on top, I would say. They have the side skirts to ward off flippers. They have the aggression, they have the 18 horsepower drive. Firestorm 5 is piggybacking its way towards the pit and just turns out in the end. That's good driving. Oh, slammed against the angle grinder. Storm 2 is getting stronger as this fight goes on and Firestorm 5 weakening. The veterans need something. Storm 2 again, the push, Firestorm 5 gone! No grand final this time for Graham and Hazel. A wedding day to look forward to, but no grand final day on Robot War. Storm 2 through. Well, a turn up for the books. The 16th seed beat the second seed. Storm 2 through to the grand final. What went wrong? The player that we got at the front got bent. Yeah. And then we couldn't get under them. We got under them a couple of times until it got bent, and then we, uh, we lost it. So they're very low to the ground, aren't they? Very low, yeah. And so once you were bent up, you just couldn't get in. That's right, yeah. So you're very popular. We hate to see you go, but you never seem to, to, to do the business when it really counts. Yeah. I say there's, there's a lot of good new robots coming through. They are. Um, say, do something different next year. Yeah. Same role, a few mods still. Yeah. I think you've got to, you've got to d develop a killing streak as well. You're just a bit too nice. No. He is nice, isn't he? <laughs> so when are you getting married? Next June. You're getting married next June? Yeah. <laughs> That'll keep you out the shed, won't it? Won't it just? <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, what a robot, what a team. Let's hear it for Firestorm!